Hi, this is Heather with Keep It Simple Social Media. And in this quick video, I am going to show you some of the new looks to the Facebook business suite. So here I am on my personal profile and I want to go to my business page. Well, over here on the left-hand side are your shortcuts to get to a lot of the other options in pages that you have. You just click the word shortcuts and you'll get a drop down menu. Now what I'm looking for, I have several business pages. You would have just your business page there and you would click on it. Now what I want to show you is here I am on my business page, but if you look in the top right hand corner, that is my personal profile. In that little tiny circle, I still have not switched over to Heather Clifford EXP Realty. And you can see down here in the little circle, that also is my personal profile photo. And over here, we have a little drop down menu and it asks me if I want to switch, but this is only switching in the commenting mode. So now it's switching over and here I am back on my business page up here in the right hand corner, it is my business page logo. So if I click on the home button on the left hand side, it actually takes me to the news feed of my business page. Now I have to click on my business page to get over to the wall on my business page. But let's say I want to actually create a post on my business page wall, and I also want my post to go on Instagram. What I need to do today, once I know I'm actually on my business page, by looking at the little circle up here, my account, this was another way that I could have switched over to my account by clicking on it and then see all profiles, and then from here, choose my business page profile. So now what we're going to do is we're going to look on the left hand side under professional dashboard, click on that. And then down at the bottom, it's going to say the meta business suite. We're going to go ahead and click on the meta business suite because it is in here that it gives us an option to create a post. So wait till it loads. And here we have create a post. Now, the reason I want to use this bar is because I can go on both Facebook and I can go on Instagram by clicking create a post. So it opens up my menu. Now, if you notice over here, that's got the little tiny Facebook logo. Uh, what I actually need to do is click the drop down arrow and also check the box for Instagram. I want this to go to both Facebook business page and my Instagram business account. You must have those accounts joined. You can do it from your smartphone on your Instagram account, and you can also do it in your business settings on Facebook. Now I've got both of those chosen. It says add a photo. Now for some of you, if you've got this clicked, you notice it covers up add the photo. Make sure you click outside of the box so the media aspect of this post shows up and you can add a video, you can add a photo. We're gonna go ahead and add a photo. You need to know where your photos are. I'm gonna choose 10 photos. Two, three, four, five, there's my 10 photos and I'm going to go ahead and open and it's going to start loading the photos. Now I don't know the order for which it's going to load the photos, So I actually have to rearrange each of the photos as I want them to appear on the business page. And I want those ones in the back. I want all the kitchen ones up front. And I want the bedroom one down. Sometimes I have to make my screen bigger so I can see the pictures. So I'm gonna move this one down here. And then it gives me a preview over here on the right hand side. So I can see if I like the arrangement for which these pictures are loading. This looks really good. I do like that arrangement. And now what I need to do is I need to say something about this post and I've written it all out already. And then I'm just going to make sure that it lines up. I've got a link to
So you see, I've got it all written out. I got a new price here, so. There we go. Welcome to, perfect. Now what I wanna do is I wanna add a location with a little teardrop here, add a location. This property is in Courtney. British Columbia. See, I had to write the BR in order to get British Columbia and then I save it. Now I'm pretty happy with my post. It's going to go on Instagram, Facebook, and it is also ready to go out. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just scroll down the page and for And I'm going to click publish now. So I click publish now. And there's also another little spot, publish now. And there we go. It shows you your, this is an Instagram story. It's archived. Here we have our Facebook post and we have our Instagram post. Now I want to go into Instagram. I want to add my hashtags because I did not add them. But the other thing I want to do is I'm going to click on the home tab. And then I'm going to click on manage Facebook page. And from here, what I like to do is take it one step further by clicking the see more button. I'm going to copy all this content and then I'm going to click on each photo and I'm going to edit and I'm going to add the text into each photo and I click done now and I just go through all 10 of the photos and what I've noticed on a lot of these is it's showing up really really big um, you just have to get through it. There's a lot of glitches on Facebook. Things have not changed. <laughs> so there we have it. We've added the text to each one of the photos. I like it to sit on the page for about four to five hours before I turn it into an ad to see if I can get some organic reach out of it and some comments and likes before I turn it into an ad. So this post is on my Facebook business page now. I finished my circle by adding the text to each one of the photos. I'm now gonna open up my smartphone. I'm gonna to go to my Instagram account and I'm going to add my hashtags and I'm going to remove where it said, send me a private message right here on Facebook and I'm gonna change the Facebook to Instagram. And that is a quick little walkthrough of the new look to the business page um, and the business suite here on Facebook as of November. Point.